To work, the, to work with the leave it command, we are going to introduce first the take it, which means that you are going to give the uh, permission to your dog to take anything, either from the floor, your hand, when you go for a walk. In this case, we are going to start with your hand and putting the treat in an open hand like this. Take it. repetition doesn't need to be many because this is something that your dog would love it because it's taking the treats as soon as I use it. Then we are going to uh, teach your dog to leave it. So leave it. Yes. So what I did it was put the treat in there. She was about to take it because the game it was before in that way. She was allowed to take the treat. But if your dog is trying to take it, just close your fist and then wait for your dog to move away. You don't move your hand. Your hand has to be steady. Leave it. Yes, take it. As soon as your dog move away, and even better if look at you, then you are teaching your dog to ask for permission. So this will be a few repetitions every now and then during the day and for a few days increasing the time of uh, the release of the treat and the difficulty so your dog will be getting better and better so leave it yes take it this time she didn't go close to my hand but she didn't look at me so you i make kissing noises you can make kissing noises too uh, motivate your dog to look at you. So we'll do again. Leave it. Yes, take it. As soon as your dog look at you, remember the marking word of yes, or if you are working with a clicker, you have to click right away and give it the reward. In this case, the treat. Leave it. So, as much repetitions you do, always finish when your dog is successful. You don't want to finish when he is making a mistake. So, leave it. Yes, take it. This hand signal, I introduce in it, so sometimes you don't need to say the word, you just do the hand signal. Again, that will be uh, quite a few repetitions, six, seven times until your dog kind of get it and work a few times during the day. Leave it. Yes, take it. Okay. When your dog is really good with the uh, open uh, hand, then you can start doing on the floor. And the same. Leave it. What she's better in this way, well, probably you can see it in the video. I didn't set right thing, but it's because she's more, it's the, the food is not really close in front of his, her nose. So it's less difficult for the dog to find that uh, desire to eat the treat. So maybe we are going to move a little bit further so you can see. Come on, baby. Sit. Let's see. Have the treat and I say, leave it. So I wait longer for her to be allowed to have the treat. In this case, you are increasing the difficulty for your dog to have the, either the treat or something dangerous when you are cooking and, the, and there is onion that are uh, following on the floor or when you go for a walk, your dog has to respond right away to the leave it command. So we are gonna do again the uh, two options, like a, in my hand, stay. Leave it. Yes, take it. So I wait for her to look at me. And then I'm gonna do it the one on the floor. I show the treat and I say, leave it. Yes, take it. And I wait a little bit longer this time. And finish the session saying, all done, that's it, no more. And you 
know, we'll be happy, of course, because was performing really well.